Hi, we're ready to show you the arts and craft today. I'm Captain Question and this is Captain Snickerbelly. We're making sure we're six feet apart and we're wearing our mask. You should do that now if you haven't. Arr. All right, this is called a mate painting. You're gonna start off with some brown paper. You're gonna get some paint with some paint brushes and you're gonna have a black marker. So, if you want, you can go on the, onto the web and look up some pictures about a mate painting so you can get an idea on what it should look like. Where, I'm going to read the direction and Captain Snickerbella is going to do the project. Where are these kind of paintings from? They're from Mexico. Mexico? Yes, Mexico. All right. So, we're going to honor our friends in Mexico. So, let's start the arts and crafts. After you looked at some real pretty pictures of Amante, uh -huh. you're going to you're going to crush up your brown paper. Okay. Just crush it up. Ah. Just crush it up. Just crush it up. Wow. Oh. And then what? And then after that, you're going to lay it flat. Oh, okay. Can you crush it more than once? Yeah, I want to crush it again. Well, you want to make sure you can still lay it flat because you're going to have to draw with markers so these line holes. Yeah. Now, if you're too tiny and it's hard for you to draw on crushed up paper, you can do like I would do. I'm going to draw mine on the uncrushed paper, just on the flat brown paper. Now, we're going to decide what we want to draw. You can draw things like a scenery, or flowers, or whatever you like for your picture. And you're going to use the black marker. So the black so marker is first. Yes, yeah, so Snicker, uh, Captain Snickerbelly is drawing a rectangle. See that? Mm -hmm. That's like the picture frame. And now he's going to make mountains. Oh. And the only thing he's doing is making triangles. Mm -hmm. And then there's some landscape. And you want to make sure you don't put a lot of black marker in because you're going to use paint to paint inside your, your picture. That's why each person got some paints. And some kids might need to share with a brother or sister. Yes. Remember how Jesus shared the five loaves? Make sure you share that way. Okay. So now... Now what? The next thing is you're going to have to use the watercolors. Okay. Make sure you have your cup of water with you so you can rinse your brush after each different color. Okay. So Snickerbelly is starting with yellow. For the sun. You're going to have to make sure that brush is good and wet to pick up that paint. <laughs> and if you get out of the line, that's okay. Your kids, you get to do that. All right. Well, we can start to see the color there. And there it is. See how the yellow is coming up? Sometimes it takes a lot of work, but don't lose heart. Just keep doing it. Make sure you rinse your brush after each different color. And now he's going to paint the grass. It's a tree. Oh, it's a tree. It sure is. Sorry. Arc, it's a tree. Yeah. Got some more trees over here. That's starting to really look nice, Captain. Arr. The Captain is doing it really quickly so we don't get too bored on the video here. But you yeah. kids can take as long as you want. 
And so now we've got clouds coming up. Now remember, that brush has to be really clean before you switch colors or it'll look like a big mess. And Captain Snickerbelly was very careful to make sure that brush was clean before he put it into the white paint. And if we have any camp counselors there, make sure you help the younger ones. Yeah, we're hoping that this week some of the younger uh, or the older uh, kids will help the younger ones and they can be camp counselors. And then yeah. when we make the t-shirts, we'll figure out who the counselors are and you will get a Young Leaders Counselor t-shirt. Yes. All right, I'll do one last color before I say goodbye in this video. And then we're going to leave it up to you to finish it. That's right. And I will finish my Amate painting later. Thanks for staying with us. Okay. Can you hold it up and show us? Oh, of course. Now, Captain Snickerbilla, do you get to see your mother very often? I bet she Sometimes. would like to. I bet she would like to put that on her refrigerator. Oh, she has a great refrigerator on her pirate ship. Oh, that's wonderful. Goodbye from everybody. Bye.